holiday season is officially in full swing, which means the winter cold is coming. Our coats and toys for kids teams are all out across Maine today, ready to thank you for your donations. We'll head over to Pratt Abbott on Forest Avenue in Portland now. Keith Carson, David Guildford, Zach Blanchard are all, all up early for one of our favorite days of the year. Good morning, guys. Hey, good morning, Chloe. Unlike our friends in Auburn, we don't have a mall or a Walmart or a Target across the street, but we do have two Starbucks and two Dunkins basically <laughs> within a two mile radius. Yeah. That is plenty of fuel for folks who want to get up this morning, come down and donate some new or gently used coats or an unwrapped toy. And they opened the Pratt Abbott early for us this morning. Every location in the state is going to be cleaning these gently used coats when you bring them in. Um, and we have some good news and some bad news, guys. Good news, we already have some uh, yeah, yeah. toys some for some toys kids. And coats already here. But we have plenty of room left <laughs> to help some folks out. Samantha? Folks, I should not be able to fit into this box, right? Like, there's something wrong with this picture. We need to fill this box, right? So <laughs> let's bring in our, our coats, our new coats, our gently used coats, our toys. Let's fill these boxes as much as we can. And I don't know about you guys, but one of my favorite parts about days like this is when we meet the people who have spent their entire year hand making items to drop off like the mittens the scarves the hats so i'm always excited there's usually one woman who always comes in with a big old bag of handmade goodies so i can't wait to see her this year and fill the box get me out of this box please <laughs> oh, here you go you so <laughs> we have some cool stuff and you know they talk a lot about when we did salvation army when we visited them they talked about the same thing which is they'll take any toys um, that you have and that's great but they have trouble typically with slightly older kids yes. mm. because it's a, sometimes maybe a little harder to figure out what to get them or whatnot. Uh, there's a toy in here actually not to pan through the box again but this thing is like the Hot Wheels thing. Oh. This is kind of in that zone of like slightly older kids. Here you go. Wow. Yeah. Um, that would be. Um, not messing around yeah. this morning. Really so. you don't, now you don't have to bring something like this to be clear, um, but they do talk about like slightly older kids yeah. um, are harder for, for them to get donations. So anything is appreciated, but this stuff is great. If Luca doesn't come in and take this thing, that would be a, a victory for us. <laughs> and again, unwrapped gifts here. They'll handle the rest. Um, Pratt Abbott helping us out throughout the morning. So. Keep coming into locations across the state. For now, Chloe, we'll send things back to you. You guys, I was wondering where Sam York went, so that explains it. She was in the box. 